Hello everybody, my name is Mathis and welcome to the Saturday Wrap for today, July 4th. Happy 4th of July, uh, 2015. I didn't get a video done yesterday in time for the Friday Wrap, uh, but I knew what I wanted to do this week. We're actually going to be doing something a little bit different. We're not going to do the kind of chill vlog that I know that I usually do. Uh, I get asked often enough to do some reactions to my old videos, like uh, my old stuff. So that's what I feel like I'm going to do today. So for those who don't know, uh, I had an old YouTube channel before Mathis Games that was called Mathis Starcraft. And as you can see it, it's right here. Um, I had this sweet picture up and I oop, balked the camera there. Um, and I used to start or I started doing uh, Starcraft 2 castings. That's how I began. And then I eventually went into uh, indie games. So we're going to be listening to a couple of my older videos. I, I, God, I, I, every once in a while I'll go back and listen and, and man, it's bad. We'll start with one or two StarCraft 2 casts and then we'll move over to when we did some indie games and maybe an old vlog or two. Who? I don't expect this to be that good. So let's go into the videos. We'll sort by oldest, I guess. Oh, Jesus Christ. Yeah, we'll look at those afterward. All right, so this was back in the day when I could only upload videos that were 15 minutes in length at most. So a lot of my StarCraft 2 casts ended up being two parts. Uh, this one has a little bit over a thousand views because I have tweeted this out before. Um, just to say this is my old stuff. I only recently, within this year, have, had, have made this stuff public. Um, all right, let's load it up and listen to myself. Oh, I'm not. I'm not excited. What is going on, YouTube world? This yeah. is Mathis four four. Thumbs up for sounding exhausted. Subscribe. Great. Cast. This will be between our purple Terran M die star <laughs> and our All right. red Zerg. <laughs> first things MTW first. It's at 360p. Is a, I that's it. Say a 360p for the Zotac um, um. Now I have to pause it for a second. All right. Jesus. First of all, I'm super itchy right here. I got like a my my nose is driving me nuts. Um. So first of all, I sound fucking bored as all hell. This is interesting because I don't remember, uh, I remember the introduction to this video and I remember recording parts of this particular video. It's funny, one of the things I used to do back in the day um, with these with these casts was, uh, I was not a very good player at the time. I was a Copper League or Bronze League or whatever. Um, and I eventually got to Diamond League. Um, but in the beginning I was really bad and I wanted to cast StarCraft anyway. So I would watch these games first and then I would uh, watch them one or two times, and then I would commentate over them and make these predictions as to what I thought the players were going to do that were always spot on uh, because I watched the, the game replay multiple times. So it made me sound like I, I knew what I was talking about. Beside the fact that I sound bored as all hell. Um, it's weird because it, this is in the beginning. This is like four, almost five years ago now that this has gone live. And uh, <coughs> this is part of the time where like, like, I was still not used to talking to myself, kind of, or talking in a room by myself. Talking to you guys or talking to whoever was watching these shitty things. So I just remember I almost was speaking and it just didn't feel natural. So I came off as incredibly bored or tired, which I was probably tired. I know a good amount about Damaga himself, but no, as don't. far as M-Star goes, I wish it, I could tell you more. No, his um, name was Die Star. He was part him, of a Millennial, the team. Um, this is going um, to let's fast forward to see if we can find like some action seven. or something. Because uh, usually during these things... Ten Zerglings on the way. Um, and yeah, he, okay. Again, which... Eh, it's not going to stop with the heavy uh, aliens. <laughs> Uh, uh, not the best uh, yeah, you can't really figure out what I want to do. Uh, I want to see if I can find some action here because that's when you're supposed to right now, really pump up the, the commentary. God, this 360p. All. all right, we he got looks like a, up these corners right an here, encounter. He does not have any. Oh, there we go. We have a little movement up here, taking out those Hellions, giving him no sight of the uh, the high ground, but he's moving in his small contingent of Marines and two Marauders. He's going to back away, does not want to get. He knows there are oh, tanks over there, so he does not want to get to that corner over there. Wisely spreading the creep, allowing I, for more in and out movement. The thing is, like, a lot of the time I'm in, in this, I'm, like, just kind of jabbering on about nonsense. Because I wasn't very good at filling dead air. <laughs> it's debatable whether I'm better at it now or not. Um, but during these things, I always felt like you needed to talk a lot. And you did. Um, but I was not good at just on-the-cuff commentary. Now, of course, as I did commentate more and more on StarCraft, I did get better at it. Uh, which we'll go look at here in a moment. So that was a, the very first one that's on this channel. Let's see if I sound any better here. Good evening, here. people of the YouTube. This is Mathis Starcraft, and I've got a nice little treat for can you. We, can we this hear that again? I'm sorry? Did how, how did I intro that video? 
Good evening, people of the YouTube. This Good evening, people of the YouTube. This is Matt the StarCraft, and I've got my what? for you. This is going to be a 1v1. Good evening, people of the YouTube. Of cast, uh, um, two players, so video Sun looks better. Sue, it's in 720p, of, uh, which is good. Uh, he is a master's player in the YouTube. I actually server. sound a little bit better. I'm trying everything and my uh, and everything in the kitchen sink, trying to get my frame rate better. I've, I've even put having StarCraft run on one of my processors and Fraps run on another. It doesn't really do anything. Um, so, so this is the part in time where I started realizing that my computer wasn't good enough to do the, the stuff that I wanted to do. I wanted to run a game, record a game, pro like all the stuff. But at the time, I hadn't built a computer specifically for it. So the frame rate was dropping and I was pointing it out um, a, a bit here. But I actually have it in 720p. So fucking nice going three years, four years ago, Mathis. You, you made some improvements over time. Uh, we shall see. I, I, I sound like I actually know a little bit but better what I'm doing. Top, as far as the workers is concerned. Now, I had played a lot of StarCraft over that one to two years where StarCraft was my main thing. So I don't, a good thing for Saunders, I don't doubt though, that I knew what I was uh, doing. Was a little bit more at least. Personal life stuff. But I definitely want to get some stuff. I do have my first loss uh, that I posted for Mathis versus the Ladder. It has to do with it, Cannon Rushes. So feel free to check I'm actually that out. talking. I'm actually act discussing like other things or during the dead air. So we can consider that uh, an improvement. Uh, happening. Indie Corner, Mathis plays Project Zomboid. Alright. Uh, this will be interesting. So, okay, a redo? I did a, a redo? Alright, this is, oh, this is the first time I think I ever recorded Project Zomboid, right here. That was Project Zomboid, right here. Interesting. Let's go ahead and full screen this. I'm just, I think I let the intro go because I was like, this will be dramatic. Let's let the intro play. It's a fucking long ass introduction. Jesus. Gentlemen, to a new. Okay, here we go. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to a new little uh, section of my. I can barely hide my excitement. You can hear corner. it. I am playing a game called Project Zomboid. If you did not see it, and I wasn't talking because I wanted you guys just to hear the music for a bit and just kind of read the introduction. The same one I'm <coughs> getting. This game is. As far as I know, pretty awesome. As it's far as I know, pre pretty awesome. And this is just a tech demo. And uh, here this we is see old. A character with his wife, and she says, "I'm sorry." I I'm still sorry. sound I'm so bored. Christ, it hurts. Uh, oh God, I'm trying to do voice acting. Sorry. Right, this is bad. I know this is bad, <laughs> but we're we'll, we're still here. We're 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 Good. Am I supposed to click? You're still breathing. I must have to. Oh, I think I was All supposed to click. Stuff, they just took it. Okay, just hold on for a second. Let me stop this bleeding. What? What? What is going on? This is like the longest. All right, fucking Christ. Let's just wife, fast right? forward a little bit. This is like the tutorial. I know the, I've read about the infamous pillow thing where. Yeah. I think it's to make her feel comfortable, but actually she suffocates. You smother her. You could suffocate. There used to be a thing in the kill. demo, and if you guys don't know and didn't play Project Zomboid back then, this was the tech demo. This is what they released before they released the game to be purchased in the Minecraft style of like alpha purchasing. Uh, and the and the one thing you were trying to do was I found you would, people would find a pillow and try and like comfort the wife by putting a pillow under her or maybe lift her legs or something because she had gotten bit I think or shot. Um, and what you would do is you click the pillow and click on her and instead of it using to comfort her it would smother her and you would kill your wife and that was hilarious and it was tragic and funny all at the same so time. Not a burden anymore, but that's not um, so this is yeah this is interesting. If you want to see this video, it's on my channel. It's 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 available to watch. Please don't be long. It's super so long. So this is like the things I say. I know this right. is like the intro where you cook food, you got a radio going, and then like a thief shows up and tries to murder your ass. Forcibly dispersed. Good voice acting. Good voice acting. This is another thing too. What would happen is if you were far away from the radio, which is being is already re-implemented or is being re-implemented in the game. Uh, it would only give you pieces of the word that was above it. It was basically telling you what was going on in the world But it would only go off when you started cooking the soup And if you ended up cooking the soup too long and you went upstairs to listen to the radio The soup would catch fire the the house would catch fire and you all burn to death So it was a very punishing thing see there we are right there, there a fire extinguisher somewhere? And yeah, I we're there. getting murdered. I I, I get caught on fire okay. And she burns to death. Go. I try to I think I pick her up. First I'm carrying step. her. Yeah, that's right I think I'm carrying her here. Where is she? I like lose her on the stairs or something. 
And then this is the part where I'm like, I gotta unparricade the door and get the hell out of here. But you can hear all the zombies. And as soon as you open it, because of the alarm, oh, there's a whoa. huge amount of zombies out there, and I end up dying. Oh god! Uh, yeah, I just get no. I get destroyed. No, yeah. No, no. I really, one of the things I miss, I really, like, I like the style of Project Zomboid now. I miss this cartoony style, but I get the 3D models look good, and it's easier for them to program for. Okay, that's, uh, god, I sound fucking bored as hell. Um, alright, one of the last things I want to do is, uh, let's go back to the newest, oldest stuff. As you can see, this is where I was, like, in full swing indie mode, wasn't really doing, uh, much, but there is, oh god. So, we'll watch two more things. There'll be two live action things. So, one is a, a team called Absolute Legends had hired me to be their StarCraft II uh, commentator, and they were doing an Invitational, which was fun. I don't think I got paid for it, though. Uh, and they made an ad that they told me to, like, they told me to basically say something about the Invitational that I'm going to be casting it, and they would make a commercial out of it for me to put on my YouTube channel. This is the commercial. I actually really liked the opening, but my commentary is awful. What's going on, everybody? My name is Man, Mike Martin, that otherwise chin. known as Matt the Starcraft, and I'm actually here to announce to you guys that I am <laughs> that going stupid to be chin beard. the Absolute Legends Arena Invitational for Starcraft. God, what the... It's and this is my old prizes. apartment, man. This is like... Looks like we, we didn't even get our table yet. Like, Second this is old. Second place is going to be 200. I like how I looked at my finger, just to make sure I was doing two. Oh, you're and funny, dude. Place and that's my Turtle Beach, man. We're also going to be doing an Alienware giveaway where one lucky viewer is going to get an Alienware PC, one. which is... Pretty, one lucky awesome one of you not not for us. not really, really two cool. of you there's gonna be a lot of big one of you involved in this invitational such as the wonderful and creative white raw it's always white raw oh man he was big play. back then we he was involved Zop, in the tournament we have liquid rat and a bunch of what? liquid like rat Rat was gonna be involved well. too you can actually check out all the players that are gonna be playing this is too long like i've already gone on too long like the way i was talking this should have been like under a minute at most and i think i went on for like two yeah head over to twitch.tv slash starcraft 2 that's the number two the number two that's where the casting is and the tournament is going to be happening on the 23rd. Now, 23rd. Time, as far as time wow. is concerned, it's going to be happening at 6 p.m. Oh, my God. CMT, Shut up. Central European time. And this is like how much time I'm talking. This is the longest shit ever. Wicked fun. See you there. I know they're like cutting me off like, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up. This is well done, though. Like The ad was the like the, the production value of the beginning and the end was it was well done, I thought. All right. Last thing. We've got a few things here. Uh, we have the thing where I'm announcing right here um, that I was moving over to Mathis Games. And then this is when I hit 1,000 subscribers on Mathis StarCraft, um, which was huge to me. So this is interesting. What's going on, everybody? Matt the StarCraft here in your face. In, in your face. face. I and never say that. this is my... Oh. 1,000 subscriber so thank you video. So, the, the chin strap, in case people are curious why I have this, I really wanted facial hair. I couldn't, it took me a really long time to, like, grow any beard. And I was working in the restaurant at the time, and the, the rule was clean shaven or a clean cut beard. No patchy beards, essentially, which was what I grew at the time. Uh, not that this is much better, but it's still better. Uh, so, I had to have, I kept the chin strap because it made me feel like a man. And I kept it super trimmed. There's a point in time where it might even be on my Mathis Games channel where the thing gets super, like, long and dumb. Um, this is before I quit. Because once I quit Cheesecake Factory, I let the beard go. Um, but this is before that. And that's why I have this. Um, for a few days now, I've been out of thousands. This is my old webcam, by the way. It was a 720p HD webcam. But the problem is the lighting is so bad, which I didn't know about that kind of thing back then, is that the camera was having a hard time, like... Processing everything essentially and the, it got very frame subscribers and I've been trying to figure out a way I could Do something special and uh, what, there what still might do? be something on in the works. I'm not sure yet I don't but, think there uh, is. I don't think anything this happens. This is the easiest thing for me to do and I don't want to say easiest maybe the most sensible How thing. long is this? It's because five minutes. Jesus. it's personal. It, it's me to you. It's me to the thousand of you guys that are the out there watching my stuff It's wild um, to hear me say that because a thousand still sounds like a lot to me and now I like oh, a thousand people that's a lot. And then I think, oh, wait, I almost have 150,000 people watching me now. That's crazy. That's just wild. And it's just a thank you. Uh, never once when I started up my YouTube channel did it's I ever true. plan on hitting 1,000 hitting subscribers. It's true. I Actually, when never... I first started, it was StarCraft 2 casts only. That's and it was just true. to fill a niche that I wanted to try. Yep. I wanted to try it. It was like an itch. I really wanted to try it out. And that's what I did. Did you really want to try it? Did you want to try it, Mathis? No success, or say little to no success. 
Um, I remember being stalled at a little over 200 subscribers. 237 subscribers and, uh, is where I got stalled. And I was like, all right, I like doing StarCraft six two months. casts. And at that point, I had started doing a lot of live casting, so my YouTube channel kind of sat by the wayside. I didn't do I did much try. As as it's funny because he, talk, uh, he talks. I talk about here how I did a lot of live casting, and there was a point in time where I was trying to get into live casting, and I had a couple of connections, um, but it was such a hard thing to get into, and I never really did it uh, fully. Um, Clearly, so. A lot of live stuff, um, <laughs> so I didn't need to anymore. So I remember kind of like, well, I kind of enjoyed making videos, but maybe not StarCraft because, um, A, I prefer live casting a lot. I did. Um, it was way it's, more it's, fun. It's a, it's a more exciting, uh, a better experience for me as a uh, StarCraft II and eSports fan. I love doing the live stuff a lot better. Too bad better. StarCraft is a dead game. Um, the people who kind of watch my stuff, oh, even again. the 200 On people the that were part of my, my subscriber base, That's, she, only about 30, 40, 40 to 50 maybe watched my videos, so it really wasn't doing much. And I was like, what do I want to do? I remember I used to do that a lot, too, when I talk. YouTube I used to channel. put my hand here. And I didn't know at the time. I was like, maybe play Minecraft. Man, that's overdone. I kind of want to do That's overdone. I, I probably anyway. should have done it. to get famous. I just want to have fun making videos. So I was like, oh, you I know what's really playing fun? I don't know why I was pretending that didn't matter. I love playing Project Zomboid. I love watching Project Zomboid. Yep. I can't be the only one. So let me do that. And uh, I did it when the 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 0 0.2.0 0 release hit. This and is I did what got a, picked a, up by the Indie Gaming overview. Blog, yeah. And that quickly got featured on Indie Gamer Blog. I think it was it's IndieGamerBlog.com and netted thousands of views very, very Which quickly. Which was huge. And a few hundred of you guys jumped on to my channel this like, is huge for me. I want to see a let's play of this. I want you to see you play through this. I was like, well, okay. I love playing this game. If you want to watch, sure. This is very so exciting that's when for I started me at the my time. Zomboid experience. And um, that was a lot of fun. 24 episodes. I, 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 okay, we're going to skip ahead of it. It's fun to talk about. Um, and recently, my numbers have kept going up. Hit that. Yep. Neither have I. So I appreciate it. I can't wait to sit back and play some more games with you. Review some more indie games. God, expose if you want to watch some this whole thing, go to got the a really channel. creepy one on the works. And, uh, and just having a really, really good time. I've been talking for over five minutes now. Yeah, you and have. And I probably should Jesus. stop. So thank you guys so much. Love to you all. You guys are amazing. And I will see you on the flip side. The this flip side. Signing out. I will see you... <laughs> I will see you on the flip side. That's good. Good. Uh, we're, we're doing real well there. Uh, that was an interesting walk down memory lane. There's a lot of videos like that that I could go back and watch. Uh, but I'll see you on the flip side. No, but seriously, um, curious what you guys think. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoy your weekend and your week. Man, that was a wild, wild time. And just to, to imagine that we're here now, this is where we are is is wild. It's it's something that I never really got over and I don't think I ever plan on getting over. I love it. To see how far we've come, right? It's wild. But thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, have a fantastic week. And I will see all of you next Friday. I'll see y'all on the flip side.